Hey, family and friends, it's Pastor Ralph again. You know, we're in 2024 and we're in the last days of it. I mean, January went so fast and things happened so quickly. But I have another nugget for you. And this is so important uh, when it comes to setting the course of your year. You know, I always look at January through December and there are certain things I like to accomplish, you know. And when it comes to our life and frustrations we go through, usually it becomes a big problem because we haven't learned how to be good stewards of our life. You know, God calls us to be good stewards. You might ask, what is a steward? A manager over the things that God has given you, the things that God has placed in your hands. And one of the things that helped me last year that is helping me this year, I had to do this, and you might want to consider this, learn to live within your means. Learn to live within your means. In other words, don't use credit cards. Don't borrow from your future. Learn to be content with such as you have. Work towards the things that you want and need. Have a plan for it. But you have to learn to live within your means. That means you have to take some things in your life, maybe take some things out, get rid of some things. You have to you know, dial it back a little bit. But learn, that's a, that's a behavior. Learn to live within your means because debt is not a blessing and debt is not from God. And so you're borrowing again from your future. So look at what you have, reduce everything that you have and learn to live within your means because guess what? God is the provider of all things. And when he sees that you're a good steward of what you've given, he says, to whom much is given, much will be required. But also he who works with a little well, he will grant him much. So again, learn to live within your means, defer your gratification hold back a little bit and you can have just about anything you want if you learn to live within your means and be content in Jesus' name.